Hi Dresser Kitty Swinney here. Today we're going to draw the T-Rex dinosaur emoji. So let's get started. To draw this cool dinosaur, let's first start by drawing its eyes. So we're going to come right here and draw a circle. Making the eyes nice and big to make it extra cute. And I'm going to come to the side so right here, draw another circle for a highlight and shake this all in back. Now that the eye is in, let's go up to the top and we're going to draw a curve over the eye. So at a slight angle. So about right here, I'm just going to draw this curve right over. Then we're going to start to build the face, the head I mean. So from here, we're going to just imagine this head is at an angle. So just remember that and I'm going to come about right here and I'm going to come down and about right here, I'm going to start to angle it in. And let's say about right here, I'm going to angle again. So just take a look at your, um, the proportions and see you can make adjustments. So then about right there, I'm going to start to angle it in again. So from there, let's see, then we can go to the top right here. So I'm just going to go back and forth. The top of the head will be about right here, still at the same angle. And this part is going to curve down. Okay, so we kind of know this is the area. So I'm going to make my mouth nice and thick. So about right here, I'm going to stop and I'm going to draw an angle going that way. So I'm going to draw the mouth and we're going to go up, come down right towards the eye area. We're going to go up and then across. So it's just this general shape right here, general shape here for the mouth. Just come in here and thicken this up. Now I kind of know what I want to do. And before I finish that, let's come back to this area right here. We're going to put an oval right here and then a circle right about here. There. Okay, so then now I know this is the mouth. I'm going to come down for the jaw area. So I'm going to pop this out a little bit. But I'm still continuing this angle. And I'm going to kind of tuck it in a little bit. So I want this part nice and thick too. So then about right there, I'll bring it in. And we're going to start to create the jaw. So go across and say about right here, I'll bring it in. There, got this big jaw right here. Then let's go ahead and we're going to draw some teeth. So right here, we're going to stagger them. One here and the one at the bottom. Top. Bottom. And one more. There. So hopefully he looks pretty awesome and cute at the same time. <laughs> okay, so then now that we know where his head is, we're going to come to the back right here. And I'm just going to round this off for the top of his head. And we're going to bring it down right there. And then let's come back right in this area. We're going to make a strong neck. All right here, we're going to draw a curve. And bring this down. So you've created this neck area right here. From there, let's go ahead and we're going to bring this down. And this is going to come all the way down. So we're going to angle this out slightly for the back. And let's draw the hand. So I'm going to come about right here. Bring this angle. So in this little area right here, I'm going to draw the hands. So these cute small little hands, I'm going to curve. Shoulder, bring it down. I'm going to come through. Right here, I'm going to pass this line. And I'm just going to draw two little curves just to simplify it. And then we're just going to bring it in. The elbow part and then bring it in. Right there. And then let's come right here, whatever space we have left, and we're going to finish this off. So this is kind of like the tummy area. So notice it's still going at an angle. Then let's draw the other back hand. So about right here, I'm just going to pop out this curve. Come down just like the front one. Two. And bring it in. 
of the other hand. A little bit thicker. Okay, so now that we know where the hands are, let's go ahead and continue. We're going to draw this out and bring this in. So about right here, close to the hands, I'm gonna come about right here and I'm gonna draw the thigh, the legs. I'm gonna bring this down. Nice big curve, basically gonna cut it off. And so just imagine this big thigh, so about right here. I'm going to draw another curve coming in to creating this shape. Right, for example, I'm just going to add a little curve right there for a crease. And so now that we know where the thigh is, we know where to put this part. So I'm going to continue down right there. So then let's draw this leg. So we're going to make it nice and thick. So about right here, I'm going to bend it in. About right there. And in this area, I'm going to curve as well. And this is the foot part. So we're going to come down, round this off, and curve in and down. And we're going to give it a heel right here. So let's work on this side. We're going to come out. So when we come out, we're not going to pass the knee. So say about right here, I'll stop. And since I'm using a Sharpie, I'm just going to go ahead and draw the toenail first. And then another one about right here. And connect. There. So it's kind of, hopefully that looks like it's split the foot. Okay, so now we have this foot in. Let's draw the back one. So about right here. Gonna curve and about right there we're gonna bring it in and then curve out just like the other side and so about right here just gonna add a curve to simplify it and then it's come out and so this one's a little bit higher so once again a nail and we're just gonna tuck it in and you know what, let's draw another one right here, just like this side. And a curve right there to split it just like this foot. Okay, so hopefully I didn't overcomplicate that. And whatever space you have left, let's finish that. And then imagine this is coming through. So right above this leg, about right here. We're going to bring it out. So now we're just going to draw the tail. So it's going to get thinner. Let's bring this down. Let's bring this down all the way to where the level of the foot. And then I'm just going to go ahead and curve it out. Nice, thick tail, right? Okay, so definitely, um, definitely, like I said, the proportions, just take a look when, you, uh, when you're drawing it. You might have to make some adjustments, but um, hopefully I helped you with that. And then let's draw some details. So about right here where the neck is, I'm gonna come in here with a stripe. And more right here. Smaller one here, and then get smaller as we go down. So they're all done. I really hope I helped you draw this cool T-Rex emoji and that I made it fun and easy for you to follow along. Thanks so much for watching. And if I helped you, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.